So we started the volunteer program in um, 2012 uh, when we started our research section of the Natus Valley Trust. Um, we actually developed a nice reputation with our, within the local communities and we thought the next step for the Natus Valley Trust would be to take it um, to a national and international level and what better way to do it um, than through research. Um, and we got Dr. Mark Brown in, he's an ornithologist and a zoologist and he then came in in 2012 started up a couple of research projects. Um, but because we're such a small organization, we don't have the capacity to do all the programs ourselves. And that's when we started the volunteer program. So every week we have about three school, school visits. Either schools come down to Natus Valley or we go to the schools. Um, and then we have weekly monitoring, whether it's research in the river, because we do it on a monthly, ba monthly basis. So one week we'll be doing river. One week we've got a small little famous reserve where we monitor, monitor the plants that's mm -hmm. flowering. Mm -hmm. and then, um, so I would say a, a normal week would be probably like about three days in the field mm -hmm. and about one and a half days in, in the office, right. getting ready for programs, um, yeah. getting uh, data sheets and stuff ready, doing a little bit of research before we go out. And, and what time in the morning generally do you want to start mm -hmm. and finish? Uh, we normally start at about 8 a.m. in the morning mm -hmm. um, and we finish about um, four, half past four, depending okay. on what we're doing in that particular day. Okay. If we're doing bird ringing, ringing is, a, is an important part for bird populations to see how old they are and where they travel to, um, etc. So on a monthly basis also we do bird ringing. So we set up mist nets at the top, we catch uh, famous birds. Okay. Um, and then we put little ring ta aluminium, aluminium ring tags on, on their little feet um, mm -hmm. and it weighs nothing and so mm -hmm. on. But that ring can tell us so much data. So um, if it flies, we've got another ornithologist on the other side towards uh, Corredo and the Langkloof. So he's caught some of our birds and we've caught some uh, of his birds right. and then we can see the migration patterns uh, um, of the certain birds and so on. Yeah. So, yeah, it'll be... And yeah, so bird ringing normally takes place from about 5 a.m. in the morning. Okay, uh, early morning. And then, yeah, early mornings because you get to get, catch the yeah. birds nice and early. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, we normally finish at about half past four or later. Weekends, uh, the volunteers have off? Weekends, volunteers have off and they can explore the Lakes region. Valley all the way down to Storms River, Plettenberg Bay. So Do they have access to kayaks and canoes? Yeah, we, Natus Valley Trust, personally, we have two canoes um, mm -hmm. and it's free for use for our staff. Oh, so, fantastic. Yeah. And so the accommodation is In Natus Valley? Just yeah, he, they, they can, can walk, walk down to the, to office the office and back. And yes. back. 